Deborah, back to you for a look at our 10 most wanted antiquities, missing objects, lost due to looting and illicit trafficking. Thanks, Peter and Claire, for that very productive discussion. We hope that it's been very useful to all of you who are interested in starting your own public awareness campaigns. Since the Antiquities Coalition's founding, one of our key priorities has been raising awareness of threats to our shared cultural heritage while promoting better law and policy to the world's decision makers. As part of this outreach and advocacy, we have just started a new awareness campaign ourselves, kicking off a global search for the world's 10 most wanted antiquities. With this effort, we're enlisting the public's help to locate significant art and antiquities that have been looted or stolen and are still missing. We're shining a spotlight on these missing pieces in the hopes that someone, somewhere, can help return them to their rightful owners. Sadly, these are just 10 examples of a crime that continues to take place both around the clock and around the globe. We encourage you to visit our website, theantiquitiescoalition.org, to learn more about these pieces, their significance, their thefts, and their last known whereabouts. And we encourage you to submit recommendations for other important missing artifacts that we will feature in future lists. We know, sadly, that these are just the tip of the iceberg. We need your support to make sure that this important message reach, reaches the broader public. Please help by spreading the word on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube, or any other social media that you believe would be useful. Information is provided on your screen. And if you have any information about these pieces, please contact the Antiquities Coalition or reach out directly to your local law enforcement authorities. Thank you, Claire Buchan Parker, for your insight into how to create and leverage public awareness campaigns. And please keep reinforcing the message of combating looting and the illicit trade as we all work together to help preserve our shared cultural heritage. Thank you.